Hello again my audience of 6 and welcome back to my Dragon Quest 8, the Journey of the Cursed King playthrough. Um, so yeah, I am... Um, whoa, wrong button. Uh, I accidentally started moving and uh, I triggered a cutscene by accident. Uh, all it contained was uh, us started, starting to walk and Yang is wanting to join the fat guy. No offense. Um, so yeah, we'll be... Uh, whoa. Still getting used to the controls here. Let's see now. Uh, here we have our weapon shop, and uh, not really anything else we need from there from now. If I'm not mistaken, he's hiding in here, I think. The bar. The tavern, as it might be called. Ah, yes, here we are. Sir? Haphazard. I just love this stuff. What does he expect? So he knew it was coming? Hmm. What? Rollers is dead? But... What now? Hmm... Small plot twist here, folks. Let's talk to him again. This is a cutscene heavy game to say the least. Everyone, slow mo run out of here. Right, we should follow. We're equipped. We're well equipped. Hello. Anyway. Always had a thing for those bunny girls. They're cute. <laughs> oh, right. Uh, where were we supposed to go? Um, most likely this way. Slow mo running. Come from that. What? We want to get down to the courtyard. But it's mayhem down there. There's a monster loose in town, you know. You could get hurt if you were caught up in it all. You'd better not go down there. Hmm. All right. Um. Right. Uh, churches. This one. Uh, this is where you save your town by confessing your sins and whatnot. It's quite ingenious, although quite irritating as well. 
And I'm still getting the hang of the controls here. As I... Whoa! Wrong button! As I tried <laughs> navigating past badly placed obstacles. I'll just have to log on my school computer again. There we go. Uh, barrels! You can get all sorts of stuff from this. Yeah. See? Two gold. Medicine hole. Oh, blah, blah. Let us heal you, if you didn't already know. Oh, I just went in a circle, didn't I? Great stuff. You just have to go through here. I'll talk to this guy. What's all the fuss about? Huh, you tell me, brother. There's a monster in town. Now I'm gonna slay it. Hello, kitty. Most likely this way. Whiteness, no blackness. Cutting yet, though. Let's see how this goes. And suddenly, Yangus appears. Yeah, what the indeed? Yeah, this ain't good. Wait, what? Sudden turn to the right. Yeah, we must look lively. <laughs> I love how that guy in the background is standing there like, Duh! Oh, so that's our monster, eh? <laughs> yeah, he did look at you. To the face. Let's throw rocks at it. <laughs> I am a horse. Good horsey. Good, good. <laughs> Racism, anyone? Even in si existed in there. Yeah, we get it. Out. You may stop shouting now. Thank you. Fine reception indeed. Obviously not. Obviously not. You probably will, you know. I hate to break it, you might, but he's sort of six feet under the ground now. Yes, I'm afraid so. That was spilt good milk, though. That sounded kind of wrong. Epic slow motion talking. Well, that's true. Indeed we will.
he said with a slow tone in his voice. Girl? Hiyo! We'll take it. You look from it, eh? In Mother Russia, Faye would ask you. Just kidding. Can't get enough of those jokes. Talk to the hands. Surprise. Hello. <laughs> to the face. Monster. Wait, we can? <laughs> Referring to me? Sorry, I skipped it. <laughs> it's so good. Don't mind me. Nice now. Most peculiar. I say. Yeah, me too, if you find it annoying if I'm talking through the cutscenes. Yeah, make us go through the entire town with 30 frames per second. That's going to look pretty. Ooh, speaking of pretty. 30 frames again, I wasn't talking about the girl. He isn't that ugly, though. I mean, I'd look at him. Although not in a sexual way. Cough, cough. Oh, yes, we must. My boy! Yes, sir. Right, we'll just make our way to the church and then I'll call it quits. There are a lot of cutscenes in this game, and they will be slow, some of them. And you'll hear the music going from really fast paced to really slow and terrible paced. Crack, crack, crack. I say, what more can I say about this game? Um, my character. I don't think this is a spoiler, no it's not. He can choose from... Whoa! There we go. Three, maybe four weapons. If you count your fists as weapons, so I guess they are. Um, that is the sword that I'm equipped with now, a boomerang, and a spear. Uh, I think in this playthrough I will go heavily into the spear. Just because um, I haven't done that in any of my other playthroughs, I think. Ooh, I'll take that. And, uh, so yeah. We'll just, you know, jump in here first. Kill ourselves. There usually is some special items. 
lying out and about in the... Uh, yeah. We found a shield, which is always good. If I just can remember how to, you know... Uh, there we go. I would like to transfer it to Dante. Who will equip it? There we go. Slight defense bonus. Now Yang is on the other hand. Uh, he uses clubs, axe, and scythes. Um, and his fists, if that's, you know, what you want. But I prefer going axe on him, simply because he has an attack that is incredibly powerful with the axe. And it's really vital during boss fights. If it lands, of course. So, another cutscene, of course. And I forgot to go to the church. Damn it. Oh, right. We'll just... We'll, we'll manage through this one, I think. Hello? Don't worry, just going to go through your things. Don't mind me not looking in your panty drawer at all. Ooh, another thing. Ooh, yes, we need those. Gold we need. Anything else in here that we can crush? Not that I know. Let's just check the house first. You never know what you might find. Ah, bloody computer. We found nothing there. And if you look, uh, you can even read books if you find anything interesting. And I'm not going to spoil it. Um, but you ga usually gain something interesting from reading books. Monster behavior. After many of your long years spent researching monsters, I have reached an unexpected conclusion. It appears that nocturnal monsters are far stronger and more vicious than their daytime counterparts. What an incredible discovery! Now I must redouble my efforts to fathom the secrets of monster biology. I'm just going to voice over those. Because... It's sort of fun, I must admit. Ah, The controls are still a little tricky. We'll talk to her. And then I'll save it and see if I can find a way to, you know... Hello! Uh, you know, raise the frame rate. I don't mind. Perhaps. Uh, yes, please. Really? I'm sorry. <laughs> you know, such things happens, you know? Or because of that. Entryness. He's drunk. Hmm. Boy, I'm a man. Yeah, never mind you as well, fucker. So I see. After that you get in the kitchen and make me a sandwich. Just kidding. I'm not a sexist or anything, I just like making <laughs> such comments. Nothing offensive, I swear. Hmm. You know, I was like that once before. Not really. Oh, 
Doesn't look like it. Girl, if I can get you into bed, I will bring you a crystal ball as huge as the moon itself. Yeah, I think so. What happened afterwards? Nudge, nudge. Boy, I sure hope that comes through as well. What? Ah. To the south. That's the key word. I, I, I suppose. Not getting ahead of myself, eh? But we have nothing more to do in here. Exit it. Exitness. There we go. Alright, and the church is where it is most likely over here. And Norton fell to launch, yes I know. Now I completely fucked up my controls now. No I didn't, never mind. Here we are. Move, hairy man, he's probably Canadian. Stereotypes, you know. And here we have the church. Can we loot this place? No, we can't. We can loot the all uh, churches later in the game now. Uh, how can we loot this place? Housekeeping! Huh. Ooh! Hiya! Ooh, see? Always wise to do that. Right, we're running a bit of overtime here, so we're just run to her. Welcome to this house of the goddess. How may I assist you at such a late hour? So we have the confession which is save, uh, divination which is um, you can ask her how long you have until you level up, how much experience points you need, resurrection, you bring him back from the dead, purification, uh, that fixes, I don't really know, ah poison of course. And we have removing curses on the benediction. Anyway, we are going to confess our sins. Declare your sins and your achievements before our great and benevolent goddess. And I shall record them in an adventure log. Yes, please. Breaking the fourth wall, anyone? Uh, yeah. We'll save over this one. Yes, you must. Huzzah! Huzzah! We are that good, guys. We are that good. <sighs> Not at the moment. We are ending it off here, and we'll see how it goes. So yeah, that was um, Dragon Quest: The Journey of the Cursed King for you. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Good day.